People love going to the beach but often don't look down or don't take too much notice of what's washing up. So a lot of people are really surprised about what we have been finding on the beaches. When we started and I first saw cotton buns on the beach, I didn't realise we were going to find all this other stuff as well. Well, there's a lot of these little army figurines, little bits of Barbie stuff. A lot of people don't know that there's plastic in tampons. That'd be something that's just going down the probably the kitchen sink. Cool, but toilet brushes and just all sorts of random things that um, that do tend to wash up. That there is a lollipop stick. You can see the hole in the end. But these other ones um, are cotton buds, and these were floating in the in the rock pool down on the beach. That was over 12 months, so we've yeah. collected another 10,000 since I took that photo. They actually uh, get discharged out of the sewage ocean outfall, so people flush them down the toilet. Um, there's also um, stories that people put them down the, the sinkhole as well in their bathroom. Like, don't ask me why. And because of their structure, because they're really quite thin, they can get through um, most screens at, at most treatment plants. If you collect the data over time, you can actually see whether, um, you know, whether that problem is decreasing or increasing and, and all that sort of stuff, which is really valuable information. There has been a lot of behaviour change that we've been doing over the last two years, just making people aware that, hey, if you flush this, it can end up on the beach. But what we really want to do is um, phase out plastic stem cotton buds in Australia, because basically there's no reason for them to be made out of plastic. Um, and it was, it's been done in other countries, so the UK, Europe, Scotland uh, and New Zealand that have all um, phased out plastic stem cotton buds and have found alternatives. So um, we can't see why that couldn't and, and should, shouldn't happen in Australia. Yes, we're helping our local environment that definitely has impacts on what's happening in other places. This beach here is part of the Great Southern Reef. And so what happens here will impact on beaches further afield. And if we all do our bit, we're really helping each other out.